everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jessica and today I have my intro for 21 in 2021. Yes, I am doing 21 products in addition to all of the other projects that I have going on. Don't even ask me how many projects or how many products I am going to be doing because it's a lot. It is a lot, but I am doing a mix of beauty and makeup this year for most of my projects to kind of even out the playing field, so to speak. And um, we'll see if I can keep my focus a little bit better this year because, you know, last year wasn't so great. But this is a new year. Um, we're, we're doing this fresh start thing and we're, we're going to do amazing this year. We're going to do amazing things together in this community. So <clears throat> let me get into my products. I have them on a spreadsheet, but I'm just going to pull them as I have them um, right here to get the big stuff out of the way first and that way I'm knocking less stuff over because you know I, I get a little crazy sometimes up in here. All right the first one is the Cinema Secrets brush cleaner. I I have this it's expensive and um, I should be using it. I've been using like dish soap, um, baby shampoo, that kind of stuff and I really just need to use the stuff that was designed for my brushes. And I don't know if I would repurchase this, even though I have another full bottle of it, because it's so daggone expensive. And the only place I've ever found it is Sephora. And I don't really shop at Sephora anymore um, for personal reasons, but um, I, I just, I should use it. it. It's stupid expensive. It needs to get done. So I am at this red line here, and um, we're just going to see how long it takes me to get it done. If I actually use it like I'm supposed to, I should have it done this year, no problem, but this is me we're talking about. All right, um, for the next thing, uh, everything else I think is makeup. So only one beauty product. Wow, I didn't do a, a good job of uh, evening this out so well. We're, ju we're just going to go with it. Um, the Ulta Beauty Matte Makeup Setting Spray. This is brand new. Um, I can't even do a line on it. So um, yeah, we'll just have to wait till I can get some usage on it and I will have my first line, but it is really stinking full. Like there's no air in that one. So that is one that I'm sure will not be a problem to get used up for this year. Another one is the LA Girl Pro Matte um, High Definition Long Wear Matte Foundation. And this is in the color Bisque. I think I've used this twice and um, it's not like I can even mark it. It's still up in the neck area way up in there, but um, I, I, like I said, I have used it twice, but for all intents and purposes, it's pretty brand new. And of course, people are calling me on my watch. I don't know you, leave a message. That's all I can say. All right, let's get on to the next stuff. I'm gonna save the powder stuff for last because um, it's just easier that way. Um, this is the Essence Lash and Brow Gel Mascara. Um, it is brand new. I just got this and um, I'm excited to try it. Um, I got, got a bunch of Essence stuff and um, I'm, I'm really looking forward to you know, trying more and more of their products. Um, let's see, the Be A Bombshell Eye Base in Submissive. I think I had this in Pi and I've used it for a few other things. I would like to get that completely used up. That would be nice. I don't think that one's going to be a problem. I got this, I want to say like in an Ipsy bag, like 100, 150 years ago, something like that. And um, the ones that you get in there, they're not um, like jam packed full of product. Like there is plenty of glass space. And I have used it and um, I have worn it down a little bit, not just on the side. So, um, you know, it does have some usage on it, but I just felt like it wasn't a ton of product to begin with. I think this is going to be no problem to get that finished. I have a lipstick and I will be marking all of these, um, the ones that are, are markable, um, like the lipstick I'll mark on the cap and so on and so forth, or a piece of paper. This is the Avon Rich Spice Lipstick. I actually have this on today. Not a ton of product in there. But it is definitely on the reddish. It's like the orangey brown red side. And um, it's not something that I'm going to be wearing on the daily because it's just not like a me color. I'm not sure why I ever purchased it. But I've had it for a while and I would like to get that used up. Speaking of lip products, this one I've had forever. This is NARS Rakugian. I think I've used this once. 
I mean, it's, it's huge. It is absolutely huge. And I have a hair hanging off of my arm. Go figure. I have tons of hairs. Um, so yeah, I'm going to mark this one probably on a piece of paper because I can't mark it on the cap. And I would love to get that one done this year. I, even though I'm rotating through lip products this year with my 365 days of lippies, um, I do still intend to get some lip products finished and used up because it needs to happen. This one you guys have seen in my makeup basket for a while. Um, I, I can't really mark this, so I might weigh it because um, it sticks to the sides. But this is Benefit the Professional. Not my favorite. It is going to be primarily used during the colder months because me and silicone products like this, we don't, um, we're not simpatico in the warm months. It makes me like a big old grease ball. So I'll weigh this one and I will let you know. I will let you know how, uh, how that goes. And this is a new one. Also, this is the Catrice liquid camouflage. It is the anti-red or green, if you will. It's not super dark green, which is cool, but in case, um, you know, Every now and again, a girl gets a spot here or there on her face that's a little bit red and inflamed. We know how that goes. Um, I wanted a um, green. And I also do get some red like around my nose, which will be nice to have something to counteract that. We'll see if I can get it done in a year. I don't know if I can or not. All right, I got some other things in a magnetic palette here because, you know, I have tons of these magnetic palettes. Hold it up, Jessica, get it together. This is Pale Nude. I believe it's Pale Nude. Yes, Pale Nude from Coastal Scents. Um, this is Tortoise from Bare Minerals. There isn't a ton in there. It's what was left, and I would like to get that done. This is virtually brand new. It's probably only been used a few times. This is from the Depotted Profusion Eyes Palette. It is a concealer. I do have a little bit of pan on it. It was in pie. I would like to get that done. This is from the Sephora Colorista palette. It is the darkest blush that was in there. And um, I don't know if I'm going to franken that one or not. It is a possibility because um, that's, it's just really dark. It's probably too dark for me, so it might get frankened. And then I have five different shades. These are two different depotted elf quads. Um, one was Blushing Beauty and the other one was Happy Hour, I believe. So... That would be nice to get five of those shadows done. And they're pretty neutral colors, so I'm not really that worried about them. And speaking of neutral colors, the last three that I am going to be picking for my 21 in 2021 is from the Coastal Sense 88 palette. I have three shades in here that I would like to finish, and they are all neutrals. And they are this one, this one, and this one. So this second to last row, it is the first three that are left. So I would like to get those done as well. And I need to X out all of the ones that I finished up from last year because um, I want to be able to keep track of what I'm finishing each year. So that is everything for my 21 in 2021. I don't think there's anything in this particular project that is super unreasonable for me to be able to finish. Um, the only one that may or may not be a problem is going to be the color corrector in green just because I don't know how much of it I'm going to need. I've never used Catrice concealer, so I, I don't know how long they're gonna last. And this one is five mLs, so we, we shall see how long it takes. Um, this is, like I said, the only one I think that could pose a problem just because I'm not gonna waste it. I'm gonna use it when and where I need it, but I'm not gonna just slather it all over my face just to get it used up, because that's not how I fly. That, that defeats the purpose of painting for me. Um, so that is everything. If you guys are doing 21 in 2021, let me know if you've done a video, if you posted it on Instagram, whatever, I'd love to come check it out because I know as the number years get bigger and bigger and bigger, <clears throat> I'm noticing less and less people are doing them in accordance with what the year is for the, the, the number year is, <clears throat> pardon me, my throat is, always have my water nearby. But um, yeah, so less and less people are doing them each year. So I always love to follow people that are actually brave enough to do the bigger number projects. So let me know down there if you are doing this project so I can come check you out. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until I see you in my next video, have a beautiful day.